have to say that Senator Tim Kaine is everything Donald Trump and Mike Pence are not. He is qualified to step into this job and lead on day one. And he is a progressive who likes to get things done. That's, that's just my kind of guy, Tim. During law school, when his fellow classmates were taking internships at prestigious law firms, he took time off to work with missionaries in Honduras. And after he graduated from Harvard Law School, he could have done anything, but instead, he chose to become a civil rights lawyer. One of his first cases was a pro bono case representing a woman who was denied an apartment because she was African American. So while Tim was taking on housing discrimination and homelessness, Donald Trump was denying apartments to people who were African American. He is still fighting those battles today, serving as a nonpartisan city council member and then the mayor of Richmond, Virginia. He worked hard to bridge racial divides. He built the first new schools in a generation. He helped turn that struggling city around. And as governor of Virginia, he led the Commonwealth through the worst financial crisis in a generation. What did he do? He brought Democrats and Republicans together to protect the programs that working families count on. And while Mike Pence slashed education funding in Indiana, and gave more tax cuts to the wealthiest, Tim Kaine cut his own salary and invested in education from pre-K through college and beyond. Now, there's no doubt in my mind, because I'm here with him, <laughs> that Tim is so qualified to be vice president and, as I have said many times, the most important qualification when you are trying to make this really big choice is can this person step in to be president? Well, at every stage of Tim's career, the people who know him best have voted to give him a promotion. And that's because That's because he fights for the people he represents, and he delivers real results.